I'm Blake Hammond. I play Nostradamus in Something Rotten. I get just hundreds of requests today to do a makeup tutorial about how I transferred to Nostradamus. You know, people, I guess, want to do it at home, and why wouldn't you? We'll start with our base. You just want to do a little co light coverage all over the entire face, like this. You want to sort of blend this in a little bit. We'll start with the small brown brush, and I use the Ben Nye. What we're going to do is we're going to try to make ourselves a little bit older, which I think is really, really a good look for people. Because sometimes you don't want to be so young. You want to look older on the street. So try it at home. Go smile like this and take it down this little crease. We want to get the color. If you can see, get the color in all the right areas of the face. We're going to take a little bit of on the side. We're going to create some crow's feet uh, on the side of my eyes. Next thing I do is I take the brush for the black. I'm going to add depth by going through every single spot that we've already done the brown. And I know you're thinking right now, wow, I don't know that I can do this, but I, I think that really, with practice, I know you can. All right, so we add another one up here. Now we're gonna take this black one more time, and we're gonna create some eyebrows. See, I'm painting on top of my own eyebrows. It kinda gives it that look of like, going up, 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 and out. I think that's really fun. Up, 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 and out. And then I'm gonna take the black, I'm gonna do an eyeliner with it. Now, this next brush, I use for blending, and this is gonna really pull it all together. You take this, and we sort of pull everything together. Now, this is so important, people. You know, I think any of you that really love makeup and do it every day, you know, I think you understand this. I wouldn't wear this makeup every day, but on occasion, I think you'll like it. I really do. We're gonna highlight through here and here. Just get the white color there. Then we go here. It's great also when you have neighbors that can sing while you do your makeup, because it makes you more theatrical, I think. There's one now. It's great. Then white up here, I just going to go across the top, take a big blending brush, and I just blend the white down. Looks like I have a wrinkle there now. Right, here's a tip I'll give you. Don't be afraid to use your fingers. Take your fingers and just blend it on out like that. Got a little circle under my eyes. I'm looking tired. It's good. Now take the white blending brush, and you're going to pull all of these really far out. Now I smile. Instant crow's feet. It's amazing. Take a little of the red. Dab of the red with a simple brush like this. You're gonna make little pock marks all over your face. Makes me kind of ruddy and a little dirty, like maybe I've had too much to drink the night before. Oh wow, it's looking good. And then I powder the face, all of my face. Take a powder brush, brush it away. Then you take a little bit of water. This sets your makeup in so it doesn't run. Put a little bit of water on a different powder puff and just you go around your face again. I bet that's a tip you didn't know. I'm gonna take my black pencil. Go back over just a little bit where the powder sort of lightened up the eyes. Make sure they're nice and black so they can pop like that. Perfect. I went ahead and got my microphone. So if you're at home, grab yours. Then I take two simple pop clips. You have to have something that's to sort of secure it. Now go ahead and get your phone out and call your hair person and have them come on over. Hey Lisa, come on in. Hi. Oh hi Lisa. So this is called skim prep. You're wiping that powder off. It's going to dry this out. All right, and now we add the hair, facial hair. You want to make sure your microphone's still showing. We take this lovely beard. Thanks for coming over, Lisa. Yeah. See you later. And there you go, becoming Nostradamus. It's a look you can wear on the weekends or even at work. Hope you learned something from me today because I know I've learned something from you watching all of your videos all the time on YouTube. Have a wonderful day. Bye.